Sayın Şah. Your Majesty, Excellencies, we have two topics for discussion for the retreat today. The number one is external relations and future direction. The second is exchange of views on regional and international issues. I would like to propose that we combine discussions on the two topics with the request that leaders make one omnibus intervention for both and within the allotted time of four to five minutes. Please allow me to provide a brief context of our meeting today. In the last five decades, ASEAN has transformed itself to play an important role in maintaining regional order. Through various ASEAN-led mechanisms, such as the East ASEAN Summit and the ASEAN Regional Forum, our association has been able to convene these big, medium, and small powers together for dialogues. ASEAN has stayed on the path that our founding fathers have laid out for us, a foundation built on active engagement of regional cooperation and collaboration, united and solid despite our diversity. But our region faces challenges such as the geopolitical and strategic developments and greater non-traditional security threats arising from non-state actors. In the face of strategic and geopolitical challenges and the increasing reach of non-traditional security threats, Asia must continue to thrive. To succeed, Asia must remain united on all fronts. I now open the floor for your intervention. And be I call uh, Sultan Haji Satanal Bolkia of Brunei to give us uh, the first uh, intervention. <laughs> 